Hello, I'm attorney Adam Kraut with the Firearms Industry Consulting Group. Today we're going to briefly discuss the Pennsylvania Game Commission and your Fifth Amendment rights. The Pennsylvania Game Commission's wildlife conservation officers are tasked with the enforcement of the Commonwealth's game laws. Many times the interactions between the wildlife conservation officers and hunters occurs in the field. Most people know they have a Fifth Amendment right not to incriminate themselves when it comes to speaking with law enforcement. Yet, the number of people who know that they don't have to talk with a game commission officer is staggeringly less. Within the last year, wildlife conservation officers who have taken a course approved by the Pennsylvania State Police will be able to utilize body cameras in the performance of their official duties. This means that any interaction in the field is potentially being recorded and that anything you say to a wildlife conservation officer can be used against you at a future time should the officer choose to prosecute you. The Pennsylvania Game Code has a section that makes it a crime to refuse to answer without evasion upon request of any representative of the commission any pertinent question pertaining to the killing or wounding of any game or wildlife killed or wounded or the disposition of the entire carcass or any part thereof. Yet this exact provision seems to be unconstitutionally broad on its face. How can a wildlife conservation officer compel an individual to answer questions that may possibly incriminate themselves? The simple answer? They can't. Jack Coble, a farmer from Perry County, fought the Game Commission on this very issue. In 2012, a wildlife conservation officer appeared on his property to investigate a tip about jack lighting. The officer believed that Mr. Coble was being evasive in his answers. After driving around the property with Mr. Coble, the officer came across Mr. Coble's daughter and another person in possession of a dead deer. At this point, Mr. Coble asked the officer to leave. The wildlife conservation officer charged Mr. Coble under section 2126, subsection 6, which makes it a crime to refuse to answer without evasion about the killing or wounding of game or wildlife. Mr. Coble's attorney argued this was a violation of his Fifth Amendment rights and the Perry County DA agreed. Neither the Pennsylvania Attorney General nor the Game Commission appealed the decision granting relief to Mr. Coble. While the courts in Pennsylvania have not found this particular section to be constitutionally overbroad as applied to everybody, it is hard to see how the courts would not. If you find yourself having an interaction with a wildlife conservation officer, remember that anything you say can and most likely will be used against you. Did you find this video informative? Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking the red subscribe button below. Make sure to check out our blog, and if you haven't already, look for us on Facebook at Firearms Industry Consulting Group. Until next time, thanks for watching.